am taping the little Dali BMS thing. We're putting a piece of rubber just so that it doesn't touch like metal on all the metal attachment on the battery because it's gonna go right on top. Just gonna sit on the top there. And we're doing one final top up charge. We've been pretty much charged already at 3.6 on all our cells but I just wanted to give it one last top up before we do a capacity test. We're gonna run our little heater there through our inverter. Well, we're just hooking up this little voltmeter here, or this shunt. There's a shunt in this display. So you just follow the back of the drawing, basically. You have your positive connected to this bottom one, your negative connected to this, the, the second one up, and then either side of your shunt is connected uh, to the next two. So that's all we're doing for now. We're also gonna run this little Hall effect sensor with it. Uh, it's not necessary, normally we just use this, but we were seeing some weird readings on this last time. So we just wanna make sure it's accurate. So we're gonna hook these up together and just use both of them to make sure we get an accurate reading when we do our capacity test here. Somebody's gonna complain I didn't put a connector. I'm only doing a test. I don't wanna put connectors on short little wires for nothing. So it's just getting twisted on. It'll be a good connection for now. So there's a capacitor inside of here. Uh, we're about to hook this up. So when you hook it up, you end up getting a spark. So uh, I'm pretty sure the preferred method is you hook up your terminals here so that there's no chance of them touching. And then you go, you hook up your positive and then your negative or vice versa. I can't remember the proper order, but I don't think it matters that much. But basically you're gonna get a little spark. The way you would avoid that is you have a re little resistor and you just connect it with the resistor for a second and then it charges up the capacitor, the electronics inside and you won't have the spark. Since I don't wanna spark our new batteries and we have our old batteries, I'm just going to charge the capacitor really quick by hooking it up positive to negative, uh, or sorry, positive to positive, negative to negative on our old batteries charge the capacitor and then it'll be ready and we won't have to, to worry about sparks on this guy. I already charged the capacitor so there should be no spark. Now we're just waiting for the little solar, our little charger here to, to say that it's only putting in 0.1 amp and we're gonna call that charge because we're at uh, 3.6, 3.59, 3.59 and 3.58. So, you know, in the next 10 minutes, I expect this to be as close to fully charged as possible. And then we'll let it sit for I don't know, 15 minutes, a half hour, just to make sure that the voltage settles. And then we'll start a capacity test. We're gonna run the heater. And uh, now we're just gonna hook up the voltage sensing wires for both the Hall effect sensor and our little shunt here. So we'll be all wired up. All right, we're down to 0.1 volt, 14.4. And this is the cells, 3.6, 3.6, 3.6, 3.6. So we're gonna stop that there and then let it sit for a little while. We're gonna install our BMS here. We already insulated, so we're gonna just slap it on top for now. We'll probably find a better way to mount this so it's not you know, squeezing wires, but for this test it won't matter. Then we take our B negative, connect it to the negative of the battery, and then our P negative becomes our new negative for our circuits. I really don't want to over tighten these. People strip them out. So I just hand tighten them for now for these, these uh, tests. I really like just snug them very gently because I think it's like eight nano. Anyway, I'll, we'll put the, the torque spec down, but it's not very much. So if it moves a little, I just give it a little more of a snug, but really no force. But for this test, if I feel any of the terminals warming up, I'll just snug them down some more. So we're almost all hooked up. Now we just need to hook up our load or our inverter to our two ends and also our negative voltage sensing wires here. Again, we're not using connectors for these short little wires. We're just doing a test. So I'm just gonna twist them up there. And then those are gonna get connected here to our negative with our inverter negative. This bolt is way too long, but it's what I had on hand. under the washer. Hopefully if I can't get it tight enough I might have to either strip more or break down and put a connector on it. This is far from best practices but it's just for a test so I don't care. Alright well it seems like we 
on this meter it doesn't come up as being 100%, but this is as close as we're able to get it, 14.37, 3.61, 3.58, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.59, 3.60, 3.59, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 3.60, 
We've been running a capacity test for the last, uh, for yesterday and today. And we've been running a bunch of different tools, a heater as well, because it is freezing here. Even though we're in Florida, it dropped down to one degree yesterday night. So we've been trying a lot of different things just to see different draws to make it a little bit more realistic to our kind of daily use. Although we are drawing way more power than we normally do, especially when we've got the heater going, Corey is running uh, the angle grinder or the sander at the same time, I'm charging batteries or the laptop at the same time, so we almost kind of maxed out the, our inverter capacity, which is a thousand watt. So we're putting the whole system to a test. Okay, we're at 250 amp hours, we're shooting for at least 280, and we also, oh, we're losing focus. Stay focused. And the monitor below is showing what the lowest cell is reading while it's drawing the 32 amps that it's drawing. So 2.8 is the lowest cell right now. But it's balancing really well on the way down, I think thanks to a proper top balance. Oh, I am so excited. And we bought those batteries from Amazon and I'm very pleased with the seller that we bought them from because the first ones were <laughs> really not nice, but he dealt with everything so professionally and so quickly, which was something that was really important with us trying to leave here. So we're at 11.4 volts, and it seems like the inverter is starting to beep at us when we turn on the heater again here. So it seems like, oh, I turned it off. So it seems like the inverter is giving me a warning before the BMS is actually going to shut off saying, hey, uh, you know, I'm not get, I don't have enough voltage here, uh, but it's still running the load. So it just, be it was beeping at us. So I'm assuming that's what was going on. The battery is a little low. It should be disconnecting any minute now. And we're at uh, 278 amp hours. So we're gonna, we should reach our 280 amp hour capacity, which is awesome. Super stoked. I just really wanna make sure that this BMS is gonna do its job and disconnect. So it seems like when the voltage drops down in the 11.5 range, it starts beeping at us. So we're getting really close to the final. We're one amp per hour away, so this thing's probably gonna shut off there any second, I would assume. And, but we just checked all the voltages of each cell. I'm gonna turn this off so you don't have to listen to it. But um, we just checked all the voltages of each cell and what this is reading, which is like 2.4 at the lowest, which would be a little bit nerve wracking because that's too low and the disconnect should already go off at like 2.5. Um, but what's happening, I believe, is this little capacity controller that I'm measuring to see my lowest voltage is just being affected by the fact that I'm drawing current. So when I actually measure at each, each voltage, we're getting like 2.7. So I think this battery actually has quite a bit more capacity than what it's rated for because it's coming up on 280 there in just a second. And I'm tempted to not even push it just to see how long it has. But I also want, kind of want to make sure that the BMS is actually going to do its job and disconnect at low voltage. So maybe we'll keep running it. And I don't know, I'm on the fence on if I should just shut it off and be like, well, I mean, I've got the capacity, I'm happy with that. Or if I should test the BMS. But the thing is, I don't plan to ever use the BMS to disconnect the voltage. I'm always going to try to keep the batteries above 20 and below uh, 90, let's say, and keep it in that middle range so we'll have the longest longevity out of the batteries. But it would be nice to know the BMS is actually working fully. You know, we've already tested the overcurrent. We've tested the, we've tested a few features of the BMS basically and they've all passed. So it'd just be nice to know, okay, well this is actually gonna disconnect the battery if for some reason everything goes badly. We have 280 amp hours. We got our full capacity out of it. We're not gonna bother trying to uh, test the low, temp, uh, low disconnect because we're not planning on using it and I'm assuming it's working. I don't wanna push our batteries that low. There's no point just to see if we have an extra five amp hours and get them down to completely zero. There's just not a point to me. So right now we have a total voltage of 11.36, 2.88 on cell one, 2.89, 2.72, and 2.86. So it seems like they're doing a pretty good job of keeping the right balance. You know, they're, they're moving the, the, 
the voltage around as as needed from cell to cell or at least the BMS is doing its job and uh, yeah so it seems like it's working great I'm really satisfied with it now we're gonna slap a charger back on it just our shore charger just to get it back up to at least 50% so it's not sitting at this low discharge rate uh, and then hopefully we'll never have to discharge it this low again and we'll have this battery for maybe a lifetime if we can keep it between 20% and 80% uh, we'll gain so many more cycles out of it it'll be incredible so I'm really happy with the battery stoked on it we're gonna leave them a good review and uh, yeah get it all hooked up